Devil Puffs. Welcome all you Devil Puffs out there in the UCWF universe. I salute you. Yes, I do. Super fine Devil Puffs. All right, welcome to Grandmasters UCWF show 42. That's right, 42. We're bringing you a live feed, Devil Puffs. From Cincinnati, Ohio, that's where we're at. I say we, because I'm here, and my unseen partner's here, and who am I? I am Sergeant Dave, that's right. S Sergeant Dave of the United States Marine Corps, 1989 to 1993. Second Battalion, Third Marines, Fox Company, Second Saloon. Infantry, Operation Desert Shield, Operation Desert Storm, Task Force Tarawa. That's right. Born and bred, lean, mean, fighting machine. Lean, mean, killing machine. That's right. We're here. I got my unseen partner here. Smooth Thunderbolt. That's right. He does not like cameras. You only get to see his excellence in the ring. That's right. Hey, we are coming up on it. We have an exciting match for you tonight. We have, in our kickoff match, we have an eight-man tag elimination match. We've got... The Mutants, the X, the X Factor, the X-Men, the Mutants, Beast, and Cyclops teamed up with the Lethal Legion of White Gorilla and Mr. Hyde. And they will be meeting to, they call themselves the Barbarians. I don't know why. But it's Black Panther of Wakanda and Kazar from the neighboring land, the Savage Land, teamed up with the Brotherhood, Sabertooth and Toad, in an eight-man tag team elimination match. That's in there just, just for kickers, man. Also, we have an old rivalry that kicked off Back during Super Axis Super Allies in July and August, we have the Cabal led by Red Skull. That's right, he's back if you haven't noticed. He's got a team, Hyperion, Dracula, and tonight, Atuma going against Dr. Doom and Namer. Namer wants a piece of Atuma. And Dr. Doom, I'm sure, wants to continue to beat up Red Skull, let him know who's running what in this UCWF universe. Also, we have an any way, win any way you can match between Mephisto and Hellstorm tonight. Hell in a Cell, win any way you can. Pinfall, submission, or knockout. This is this might be the final fight for a while, not of all time. This might be one of the last fights we see of them for a while. That's what I'm told by Mr. Mephisto, who's running the show. We've got another elders match, okay? We got the elders of the universe, Grandmaster and Collector, and another friendly fire fight. We know they don't like each other. Hey. It seems to me, I'm not keeping track, but, oh, I am, but Collector, I think, is getting the best of them, right? Also, I'm in a match. That's right. That's why I'm all dressed up, man. j Dog, Smooth Thunderbolt is not, but I am in a match against Iron Man, the Golden Avenger, a.k.a. Tony Stark. And last but not least, we have a little internal feud going on with the Asgardians. 
And as a result, in the main event, Heimdall and Ronin, the current undisputed reigning UCWF Universal Tag Team Champions, will be challenged by Thor and Balder. That's right. I think that Thor is not liking that Ronin has teamed up with Heimdall, and he's going to go after stripping this title from those two and kicking Ronin back to Xandar or wherever the heck he comes from. Get that guy out of here. Okay? So that's what's on tap tonight. We'll wrap it up how it goes. We'll wrap it all, do the wrap up at the end. We'll talk to you what's, about what's going to happen on Friday, this Christmas. Christmas, high noon at Christmas somewhere. We will have a show. We told you we would. Also, this coming Sunday is Winter Warfare. That's right, UCWF Winter Warfare. It's taking shape, okay? What's not happening tonight? The champion of the universe has elected to hold on to his money in the bank contract to a time he feel is more opportune. So I know we said he'd probably be going after Craven, who is now the reigning UCWF Universal Champion, but that's off. Okay? I think we have a good idea when it's all going to go down. This money in the bank stuff. And maybe we'll know more later. Okay? All right. All you devil pups out there in Cincinnati, Ohio, watching it live on the scene. All you devil pups around the world watching this on our UCWF Championship Show channel on YouTube that have subscribed and hit that notification bell so you know when we download content. Also, hit the likes and the comments. You guys that do that. Are you ready for a fight? Because we got a fight going on. And it's going to start right now. We'll see you on the backside, Devil Pups. Simplify. Roof, roof, roof.
absolutely run like a In fact, I also think there's a better way to start this tonight than with the smash right here. Here we go, ladies and 
ladies and gentlemen, guys, Cincinnati is in for a treat. This is going to be one heck of a match. Yes. 
possible. Must want to degrade your position, of course. He slams him down with authority. Thank you. 
They will see that with the camera many times in the past. And maybe now will be a good time for him to go on the board. He's really putting his athleticism on display here. Looks to me like the gas tank is about halfway. You want to make sure it doesn't get close enough to either, that's for sure. This is exactly how we drew this one up. He's going to win an old-fashioned back right here. He's looking at it. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? He's really taking over this match now.
Yes.
to a Saturday Night Merry Christmas to our WWE Universe watching at home. Uh -huh.
catches it. Butt kick it right here. He's out of the fly. He's back into trouble here. Clearly, he went for a long and moved like that.
opportunity to win this thing. This is the right there. One, two. He's got to be running on empty at this point. High air and shot. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? When this guy is high, look at that. He's in trouble.
absolutely not on his side, my lord. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. He's playing a little possum here, my lord. It's all academic from here. What's he going to do now? I don't know if he did it for quite a while. Yeah. <laughs> 
Let's go, guys. Kelly Sale coming up here. Without a doubt, this is going to be one of the most hellacious matches we have ever witnessed. Guys, Cincinnati is in for a treat. This is going to be one heck of a match. Chopping out trees right and left. Right and left. This 
superstar that just landed the finisher here. This match is all over. Yeah, that's it. If that doesn't elevate this rivalry, I don't know what will.
at times a charm. He's really taking over this match now. He's looking at triple over there. Backbreaker. And he lands a nice counter. Nicely done.
picture here. This match is all over. It's going to be a tough time to fight back from this. Well, the first thing he needs to do is get back to his feet, which is clearly easier said than done.
MCWF Universe. We had an awesome show. We've got new champions. It did not sit well with Thor and Balder that Ronin had been recruited by Heimdall. I think there's some trickery afoot, afoot here, but... And then they went on to win the championship, the UCWF Universal Tag Team Championship. And so they challenged. This is what Asgardians do, man. They, It's a brotherhood, it's a family. They like to fight, though, you know? It's the culture. Always up for a good fight. Well, they called them out, and they won. Balder and Thor are now the champions. More on that and what that means in just a few. Let's just review real quick what we saw. Hey, and it, it was a competitive match, but it was dominated by Thor and Balder. Let's just get that straight. And before that, we saw the geriatrics of the universe going at it. And Collector came away with the win. He sure did. And... Uh, this is all coming to a head right now, I'll tell you. Um, as far as the points are going for the Contest of Champions, the Grandmaster is winning by about 100 points right now. Uh, of course, tonight's shows, tonight's fights, uh, those points haven't been tallied yet. But we will keep you posted on what that what, what's going to come down with that because it's all going to come to a crescendo here. Uh, at uh, UCWF Winter Warfare on the 27th, two days after Christmas. All right. And we saw a Hell in a Cell match. Damon Hellstorm against Mephisto, and he got a win over good old Mephisto. Yes, he did. So Hellstorm got that win there. And in a tag team, I told you Dr. Doom wanted to let Red Skull know he's welcome back. He's welcome back for a beating anytime. And that's what Namer and Dr. Doom did to Skull and Atuma. And I got to tell you, it was pretty much all Dr. Doom laying it on Red Skull, letting him know who's running the show. And, uh,. Dr. Doom and Namer came away with the win in that tag team match. And I got a win over Iron Man. Oh, Shellhead, Golden Avenger, that's right. I got him. Got me a win. And then I got KO'd by Smooth Thunderbolt at the end of my match. No harm, no foul. That's all right. Got to have my head on a swivel. I'm good. Peace, smooth Thunderbolt. And we saw in our kickoff match, we saw what? I didn't know Kazar had this kind of fight in him. So we had an eight man elimination tag. Balls count anywhere. You've got the Lethal Legion teamed up with the uh, X Men, Beast and Cyclops. Mr. Hyde, White Gorilla, going against the two jungle jungle guys, Black Panther and Kazar, calling themselves the Barbarians. I think that's because of Conan is on their team also. And then and they teamed up with the Brotherhood. And I'm thinking in the beginning of this whole thing, I'm thinking, well. Sabretooth is the X Factor here. He's the special weapon, and you know, if they don't uh, take care of Sabretooth, Sabretooth's gonna take care of them. And I was wrong, but I, I was wrong in a good way. Because what happened is Lethal Legion took out Black Panther like that. And then they went to work on Sabretooth, outside the ring especially. Usually, usually Sabretooth is where, that's where he thrives, is outside the ring, being able to use that environment to his advantage. But he got bombarded by all four of this tag team. 
in the corner there, and it was just pandemonium and bedlam, and he got a good whooping, and they're all taking turns, and that took a lot out of them, and eventually it came down to Toad and Kazar, and at that point, they had taken out, I think it was White Gorilla first, Kazar did, and just to wrap up what happened is Kazar actually scored all the eliminations and the, he got the pin for the win. I mean, they went from four on two to winning the thing. It came down to Beast and Kazar and Kazar got the win. Props to Kazar. Those points go to those guys, not me. But man, uh, that was an amazing uh, expo, ex, ex, just uh, of what Kazar could do, man. That was just wow, you know? So, anyway, so where this going? Christmas. At high noon, somewhere in the world on Christmas. We are going to drop a special Christmas program. All the championship matches are going to be on the line from the finalists of the tournament, the Battle Realm tournament. So, what we're going to see for sure, we're going to have on the tag team we're going to have Ares and Hercules, the Olympians, going against the Asgardians, who Thor and Balder, who have just won tonight for the UCWF Universal Tag Team Championship. Ares, Hercules, the Olympians, going against the Asgardians, Thor and Balder. That by itself would be an awesome Christmas present from the UCWF, but that's not all. <laughs> that's not all. Beast will be going against challenging Trico Slatterus, champion of the universe and the holder of the Grand Prix Championship. Also, the UCWF Universal Belt, currently held by Craven, will be challenged by the finalists, Super Scroll. And we're not done yet. We're also going to see an eight man battle royal. Okay? Eight man battle royal. And we're going to see, check this out. Mephisto and Ghost Rider for show. So that's what I'm told this, the match card is going to be. I hope you're going to tune in. I know Christmas is busy for everybody, but after you've had that Christmas turkey and open presents and the kids are running into the ground, why not just kick back and relax and let the UCWF universe entertain you with some good old fashioned, supercharged, super duded butt kicking? Huh? All right. Hey, I'm Sergeant Dave. We're done tonight. Hope you enjoyed the show. Subscribe to our channel, UCWF Championship Show on YouTube. Hit the notification bell so you know when we download more shows and more content. Also, hit the likes, leave comments. All right? You can also tune in on our Facebook group page called Grandmasters UCWS Show. You can catch it there. All right. I am Sergeant Dave. And I want to wish you all a Merry Christmas if you are unable to tune in on Friday. And don't forget, Sunday, the 27th, we have a completely open card for 
UCWF Winter Warfare. With all the tournament challenges happening on Christmas, that leaves Winter Warfare wide open for who knows what is going to happen at Winter Warfare. Winter Warfare. It's going to be something not to be missed. All right. Devil Pups, I salute you out there in the UCWF universe, out there in Cincinnati, Ohio. Merry Christmas. Semper Fi.